Hi, I'm a comedian, but I also know that making fun of people's bald wives is no laughing matter. A lot of people are of the mind that nothing should be off limits in comedy, but I'm of the mind that one thing should be off limits, and that's making fun of people's bald wives. When your bald wife's thinking about attending a show, she shouldn't have to be worried about whether it's one of those comedians who's gonna make fun of bald wives. Hollywood award shows are a place for celebrating heroes and not a place to make bald wife jokes at the expense of Will Smith's bald wife. You know, it's one thing if your bald wife wants to make bald wife jokes at her own expense, but it's not the comedian's place to decide whether this is a time for those bald wife jokes. When Michael Richards hit the stage of the Laugh Factor, he said some of the worst slurs imaginable, except for making fun of bald wives, because even Michael Richards knew that bald wife jokes are a line that should not be crossed. If you see a comedian making a bald wife joke at a show, it's up to us to hold that comedian accountable and say, hey, bald wife jokes are not okay. Comedy has rules, like the rule of three, things that are not allowed. Sexism, racism, and bald wife jokes, in that order. In the odd case, after a comedian finishes his or her medical assessment of the audience and finds out that one of the bald wives in the crowd was a bald wife as a result of a fashion statement and not a medical situation, even then I would handle that bald wife joke with extreme caution. If you want to make fun of the fact that someone's bald wife is having sex with his son's friends, then be my guest. But if you want to bring his bald wife's hairdo into the equation, you no longer have my stamp of approval. And despite the fact that edgelords like Chris Rock think that bald wife jokes should be okay, I hope that we can move forward to a bald wife joke free society where comedians come together in unison to say, no, I will not make bald wife jokes. And bald wife jokes are never okay. But if you want to talk about who's really mental, anyone that doesn't get the Fellas Fellas merch, two days left on the drop and not ordering some by Wednesday night would be true clinical insanity and there's no way to help you.